Hey guys, I'm Mike Eamon back here from the video. Guys, today what I want to talk about is making coins from farm accounts and what you can do right now to make 200,000 plus coins. And the reason why I say plus is because showing exactly what I'm going to show you in this video, as you can see right here, I am leveling up a farm account. I'm able to go ahead and show you exactly what I'm showing you. So, first off, if you go on your farm account, you can have four farm accounts per console, your main account plus four farms you can get 50,000 coins plus per account. So if you do the math there, that's 200,000 coins. Obviously you can get even more than that depending on your packs. Because what you're gonna be getting from this is, first off, let's go back. Let me show you this real fast. If we go over to the levels, um, do, 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 Mutt Dedication. Oh no, uh, Serious Progression. Now keep in mind guys, Going from level zero, let's say you're on a farm, right? And you didn't play. If you played last year, your farms automatically start on level 10. If you did not play last year, you start on level zero. Going from zero to 20 takes no time at all. I mean, it literally, I'll show you the exact solo I'm grinding. And I have been grinding. I have done now, uh, I think, four accounts today. And I've only started like a couple hours ago. This is really easy and simple to do. It does not take much time at all. So whether some of these farm account methods take a little bit of time, this takes absolutely no time and you're gonna get coins from doing it. So starting off right away, let's say you do start on level 10. Let's say you don't, okay? From zero to 10, I think it's level five, you get a, get a, uh, you get a silver or get a player pack, right? Level eight on a farm, you get a free, Get a gold player pack, okay? Now, so far from those, from my farm accounts, I have pulled so much good stuff. I, I swear on my life, I think those packs are just boosted because they are amazing. I, I can't pull even elites from the get, get a gold player pack from the store. Those packs, because I think it's like early on, you know, really early on when you're starting in the game, they want you to see these packs and then instantly go to the store and buy them. They are just boosted, okay? They are amazing. So that's starting off right away. That's why I said 50k plus, because you could pull a crazy good pull out of that one. Second off, once you get to level 10, so once you get through all that, you also do get a quick sell. I believe it's like three or 4,000 coins. But once you get to level 10, now we're picking up here. Now I'm gonna show you, the thing I'm about to show you, the exact soul I'm about to show you, you can do this on a farm, on any farms because you do not have to do any other solos to get this solo unlocked so first off level 12 you get a gold player pack now obviously this does give you I believe two golds and a couple of silvers very nice very awesome as you level up now you're gonna get a 10k quick sell so that's your first 10,000 coins you get two of these so you get guaranteed 20k right there plus of course as you level up you do get a gold get a gold player pack you also get a gold player pack so let's keep going though going even farther again you do get another gold player pack so you get three gold player packs total get a gold player two 10k quick sells and you also get um let me make sure i'm not missing anything you also get a smaller quick sell but this is not even it so we go ahead and we get another 10k quick sell right here's our third and final reward pack which of course is a gold player pack now the reason why i say the 22 you could keep going if you want to on a farm you could go to 25 or oh, sorry 24 and get another 15k it's really not that difficult to do and you get another 15,000 coins very easy but once you get past like up to level 22 it gets to a point where you have to start grinding the solo like 20 times per level and i'm not I, again like i said I'm making this simple, easy to the point. This is not going to take you six hours to do. Okay, the theme, the theme builder solo challenges take you six hours to do. Okay, this is going to take you at max, at max, hour and a half, hour and a half to do this. Okay, at max per farm account, you can get this all done in one one day. So you can go to 24 and get 15,000 coins, but personally speaking, I wouldn't go ahead and do that. You could if you wanted to, but so starting off right away, you get 20,000 coins. Plus again, you do get right here, you get three of these packs. So 
let me go ahead and explain where the, where the 30k comes from. It does come from, yes, the get a gold player pack. Yes, all the, those three packs. Yes, that all combines together for a 30k. But another thing you can do is actually taking advantage of those packs. Now, yes, you could sell the card. So let's say you have a gold card and you're like, oh, I just pulled this Fred Warner. Let me sell him. Okay, he's 1,800 coins, blah, blah, blah. Always keep in mind, exchange sets are your best friend. And what I mean by that is, for example, let's go ahead and show you real fast. So we're going to put these all in. And the reason why I'm doing this is because you can pull power-up players. Power-up players still go for a decent amount. I know I saw someone comment down below and tell me they thought power-ups were out of the game. They're not out of the game. You can still pull them from these exchange sets. They're, I think the the they got nerfed, the pull rates of them, and they're a lot harder to pull. But you can still pull them. I pulled them many, many times, especially doing exactly the method I'm showing you right here. This is exactly the way I'm transfer oh, getting my coins and transferring them to my main account. Now I'll show you how I'm transferring my main account in one second, because guys, this is so easy to do. It's so simple. You can make a crap ton of coins doing this. 200,000 coins. And the reason why I say 50K and the reason I'm saying 50K is every farm account so far doing this, I had made 50,000 coins per farm account. So that's why I put the number 50K. But again, you can make more than 50K. It's it's not set at one specific value, right? And that's the beautiful thing about this is you can make a crap ton more than 50,000. 50,000 just the base amount. That's how much I've been getting every farm account without having to, you know, without pretty much, um, without having to do anything else. And you're just taking advantage of these packs. You get three gold player packs now the reason why i'm doing this right now and i kind of i waited a little bit to do this until right now is because right now we have two limited time cards in the game now the chance of pulling a limited time card don't get me wrong that's really crap value and by the way i, I kind of fluffed up you can take the you can risk it for the biscuit here and put the 72s in and try to see if you can get like a high 79s or 78 79 overall card and then you can make like five six seven eight up to like fifteen thousand coins you can try that. I just did that risk it for the biscuit there, but you don't have to. Nonetheless, though, as I was saying, though, um, we got a level master team captain level up pack. So again, you can um, you you can do this any time. I'm just doing it because right now, and I waited because of the fact these limited time cards in the game. The chance of pulling a limited time card is one in a billion, but it's three free packs per account. You have let's say four accounts. That's twelve free packs. Now, how am I transferring the coins over to my main account to be able to do this? Now, the sad part is the quick sell cards are no longer have no longer have the ability to be transferred over and quick sold. Yeah, EA found it. EA caught on to our farm account methods and they did that. Nonetheless, though, whatever. Fluff you, EA. We found another way. The other way I've been doing this is going ahead and let's say I had 50,000 coins, right? Uh, for example, I'm going to go ahead and go to the veteran. You can go to any, you can do any 85 overall. Uh, I just wanted to show you the one I've been doing is um, the veterans. Okay, the veterans are, seem to be the cheapest for 85 overalls. But what I'm doing is I'm going for an 85 overall right now. I was getting these, um, I think it was Marsh, uh, Brandon Marshall. I was getting him for 50,000 coins earlier. Uh, 45 to 50,000 coins. He's 53 right now. So, for example, if I were to buy this right now, or I buy Marvin Harrison, right? I buy these cards. I transfer them over to my main account. I quick sell them for training. I believe it's 920 training per one. So, for example, if I go ahead and do that, and I take, you know, 920 training, transfer over my main account, and I could do this. Let's say you have four farm accounts. I'm, I'm looking at this in the perspective of you guys doing this, okay? It's 920 per times four. That's going to be 3680 training, okay? Subtract that by 1780. And you can do two heavyweight packs. Now, obviously, you are theoretically speaking transferring 200,000 training worth of training to your main account to do this. Keep that in mind. Actually, wait. Yeah, yeah. To training to your main account to do this. And you open up two heavyweight packs, two flashback packs. Will you make your coins back? Depending on your pools, you might. Now, the key thing here, in my opinion, is go with heavyweight. 
I've talked about this in the previous video, flashbacks suck, okay? There's not enough flashbacks that go for high enough price to, to do this. Heavyweights, you got, you know, obviously you got Joe Saley, you got um, ooh, Lane Johnson, you got a couple of them go for like 95, 100,000 coins already. Not bad. And this is how I've been transferring coins. This is how I've been making coins, guys. Farm accounts, and especially early on, like right now, when you can really take advantage of this, with the fact that it's free coinage, transferring over to free packs like this is the best way to make coins right now because you're not doing much i mean i'm going to show you the solo real fast that i've been doing and just showing you real real easy what you want to do is go get a fast cheap option okay fast cheap wide receiver we go gathered 87 speed marquise brown 87 88 speed ryan grant not coy grant let me say his name coy grant 88 speed let's go get a fast option there's so many f cheap fast options in this game right now go pick one of them up we're not you know day one of mutt these cards are cheap now go pick one up put them in your wide receiver spot even if you choose the halfbacks put them in the left wide receiver spot go ahead and go into the nfl epic solos do not go all the way down first solo 14 yards passing put that on easy play the solo and all you're going to do here, guys, come out in five wide. Pretty much every playbook in Mutt has five wide. And if they don't have five wide for some reason, you're out here with the 46 playbook. I, I don't know what you're in. I, honestly, 46 is defense. But I don't know if you're in run and gun and don't have five wide. No big deal. All you have to do is shriek your guy. So empty base set. I'm going to come out in uh, four verticals. <clears throat> I'm going to shriek right here on the left-hand side, Gavard. I'm going to put my other receiver on the slant. I'm going to hike the ball. Now, this is on arcade. So, this is going to be a free touchdown every single time. Now, I talked about this in the previous video. Your stats do not count if you hit replay. But your XP does. So, if I hit replay right now, my stats from Mutt Master will not count. But my XP will. So I can keep hitting replay, do this exact same thing I'm showing you over and over and over again. And it's, it's going to count my XP. It's not going to count my stats, but I don't care about stats. I'm on a farm account. I'm just counting my XP and getting this done. And again, guys, it's not going to take that long to get these done. Especially because these early levels, first 22 levels, again, you can get to 24 if you want to. I'm not personally doing that, but you can get to 24 if you want to. It's not going to take you much time at all. It really doesn't. It's very simple. It's very easy. And this is, again, like sniping. I kind of said this about sniping in another video. Is It's passive ways to make coins. And that, my friend, is the most awesomest way to make coins. It's just not really thinking. Sitting back. Hiking the ball. And throwing a deep pass. And you're just going to watch your coins go all the way up. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.